ready! Sunfriends Tropical Paradise of Isle Del Pino. We're so pleased to welcome you to our beautiful home. Come enjoy a natural wonderland to which we've added the world's finest resort facilities, a spectacular amusement park, and succulent seafood. Whoa. All this and more await you on Isle Del Pino. Come relax and let us refresh your body and spirit. So the adventure begins. <laughs> it's the one, the only Super Mario Sunshine. It's Super Mario Sunshine for the GameCube. Hi Dusk, nice to see you. Why am I torturing myself? It's not torture, it's just you know me, I like a good challenge, and this will definitely provide one. I've, I've wanted to try 100%ing Mario Sunshine, but now I actually think I'll be able to do it, so... That's... that's... That's generally just my thought process. And I had a hankering to play this game, so... That doesn't have... that doesn't happen very often, so I figured there's no better time to stream this than now. Is this a no-spoilers playthrough? No. I've played this multiple times. I've only beaten it once, but I've played for this game multiple times. I've beaten it, I just haven't 100%ed it before. I've even seen, like, speedruns on this. So no, this is not my first time playing through the game. If I wanted no spoilers, I would have put the no spoilers tab on my, uh, <laughs> on my stream. Yeah, I have, I did not mark this under my list of games to play. As I said, this was kind of a spur of the moment. Hey, I have a, I have a, I want to play Mario Sunshine. Also, not every game that I am planning on streaming I've included in that list. That list would get really, really long. So, there we go. Yes, I would like to create a new memory for this. It is a brick wall to get 100%. I've actually gotten, I don't want to say close to 100%, but I've gotten a lot of the things you need to collect. It was mainly the blue coins that I wasn't able to do, because I didn't understand them. But now, I actually have an idea of how to get them, so I think we actually can achieve 100% in this. This is what, this is my hope. <laughs> Yeah, so this is uh, Mario Sunshine. Oh well. Uh, wait, 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 wait. <laughs> oh, I don't know what to do. No. Oh. <laughs> Let's just start a new game. I can introduce it as it happens. The pr premise of the game: they want to go to this tropical island because Mario wants to eat seafood. Mario's in love with seafood. Oh dear. Oh, I know what's happening for the last level, for sure. That's not what I'm worried about. She's like, what? Uh, oh, it's true. I did not turn on subtitles. I forgot that was an option. Whoops. I am most concerned with the well-being of the princess in this dreadful heat. Master Mario, if you would, cross over to that shore and find some assistance. <laughs> Who spilled their gogurt on the ground? <laughs> Mario, be careful. I have a bad feeling about this. Well, it is the start of a 3D Mario game! 
<laughs> it's gonna be a, it's gonna be an adventure. So yeah, this is kind of the sequel to Mario 64. Uh, out of the five main 3D Mario games, this 64, the two Galaxy games, and Odyssey, this is my least favorite. That's not to say I don't like it, I just think it has the most problems out of all of the 3D Marios. I'm also the least skilled at this one, so we'll, we'll see how, what happens there. <laughs> this is also one of those, the first Nintendo games that actually had a decent amount of voice talent, and I, I consider this to be the game that kind of killed Nintendo's desire to do voice talent, because it's not great. <laughs> Master Mario, remember the A button is the key! Use it to show me the, some of those famous jumps! I was doing that. Don't worry, Mario! We'll watch over the princess! Go get some help! Okay. It's yogurt! Mario hates yogurt. He's getting covered in it. And if he gets covered too much, he will take damage. Hey, it's some of the locals! Oh, it's ukulele man. Welcome to Isle Delfino. Step right up and get yourself a free tourist map. Press the Z button to view your map. I would love one. We are here in the airstrip. This is your second favorite 3D Mario game. Interesting. I know some people do really like this game, and I get it, but I think it has a lot of problems. Huh? Have we met somewhere before? I feel like I've seen you somewhere, and recently too. Oh, you must be mistaken. I am Mario, I'm pretty famous, so... <laughs> Just getting reoriented with the controls. Here we go. This is what we need. Power-up complete. Thank you for purchasing this item from Gab Science Incorporated. Preparing to register customer information. Scanning and classifying subject data. Subject identified as Mario, resident of the Mushroom Kingdom. Data storage complete. I am Flood, a flash liquidizer ultra dousing device. I hope to be of assistance. Oh, well, that's funny. Galaxy 2 is my second favorite. Proceeding with user instruction. Use the R button to shoot water from my tape. If you press the R button all the way down, you can stop and shoot. You can then use the control stick to aim in any direction. Press the X button to switch to the hover nozzle. You can then press the R button to hover in the air for a short time. If this tank is empty, no water can be sprayed. To refill tank, enter a body of water and press the R button. Instructions complete. Proceed. Flood stands for Flash Liquid Ultra Drowsing Device. Or dowsing Device, I believe. No, I don't need to hear the explanation again. No, I thought the Galaxy 2 took what Mario Galaxy 1 did and made it better, pretty much. Try washing the M off. Yeah, how dare people. There are also apparently some things you can do with Flood that the game doesn't tell you about. Like that shotgun blast there, which is really useful. <laughs> hey, Miss Fernando. I like how colorful the game is, for sure. Alright. Whoosh! Here, let me clean that go grid off you. Whoa, I really thought I was a goner! Hey, hey, Non, it's you! This whole mess is your fault! I don't- I just got here! I'm just here for the seafood, man! Where's the nearest Papa, though? <laughs> what are you waiting for? Do something! This gooey paint of yours completely covered my friend! I just saved him, and it's not mine. What are you upset about? Help! Help you? Are you crazy? We're the ones who need help! Take that water pump and clean the airstrip, you... You! He, se he seems unsettled. <laughs> you can spray your friends, it's great. That goop looks dangerous! I wouldn't touch it, Mario! If you get some on you, get in the water or do a spin jump! Okay, that's pretty easy. Yeah, it's all goopy! <laughs> we 
came all this way, now look, everything's spoiled! This is the worst! <laughs> Were they on the plane too? I only... Maybe they weren't in first class. Looks like this gunk is coming from somewhere below! It's really slippery! Alright, here we go. It's the first of many bosses! The Goopy Piranha! Remember, a speedrunner, I am not. Oh man, that shotgun blast is so good. I never knew about that before, but it, yeah, that's really fantastic. And we cleaned up the Gogurt, and thus this crater just fills itself in. Makes sense. <laughs> That's true. This is probably the best story of all the 3D Mario games, but I also play 3D Mario games for the <laughs> gameplay. Shine! <laughs> One out of 120. <laughs> oh boy. Oh, thank goodness the police are here. Court is now in session. As you are no doubt aware, someone has been senselessly defacing Fair Isle Delfino using some paint-like substance. The accused is charged with polluting our beautiful home, and yes, endangering our very way of life. Indeed, how can one not be aware of what is going on? Though it is daytime in Delfino Plaza, our poor residents tremble beneath a veil of darkness. Expert shine scholars have determined that this darkness has arisen because all of our guardians, the shine sprites, have vanished from their gathering spot at the Shine Gate. The reason? It's quite obvious. This horrible graffiti is to blame. Hold the sketch of the perpetrator based on eyewitness descriptions. The truth is obvious. The guilty party sits among us. It is none other than my Objection! <laughs> Overruled. I judge the defendant guilty as charged. I hereby order the defendant to clean this entire island. Until Isle Delfino is completely free of his vile handiwork, Mario shall not be allowed to leave. That was a kangaroo court if I've ever seen one. This appears to be quite a predicament, Mario. Data analysis verifies that the island's inhabitants are indeed troubled by pollution. But the pollution itself is not the main problem. Mario, you witnessed this object at the airstrip, correct? It is a shine sprite. Shine sprites are the source of power on Isle Delfino. They used to gather in great numbers at the shine gate, but the graffiti incident has polluted the island and most of the shine sprites have fled. There is no longer any power to support the peaceful lifestyle of the islanders. It is most pitiable. The only way to ensure the return of the Shine Sprites is to keep the island from becoming any dirtier. The perpetrator is likely at work even as we speak. And you, Mario, are being treated as a criminal. Tomorrow we must do our best to resolve this situation. Mario goes to jail in this game? Yeah, that was per a perfectly timed sound alert. I love it. No, I don't want to hear the explanation again. We'll know if you're streaming this and talking with Twitch chat. <laughs> We're in Delfino Plaza. I do love Delfino Plaza as an overworld. It's quite good. <laughs> you have to question something about this? Oh, please do. <laughs> also, I, I still love watermelons. Wow, you're safe! What a relief! This vacation is crazy! The princess is waiting for you just up ahead! I would like a coconut. The ones on the right are durians, and the ones on the left are coconuts. 
If you're not buying, get lost! DBS alert, it seems several people have gone missing near the Grand Pianta statue in Bianco Square. Eh, probably nothing. Well, 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 if it isn't you, do you have that tourist map? Did I tell you to press the Z button to view that thing? Hey there, you don't look so good. It's like, well, it's like disaster is written all over your face, you know? I was wrongly imprisoned! <laughs> Well, that happens a lot. What's that? We're already having a disaster. Oh, right. He doesn't really care. <laughs> if you jump towards a tree, you can grab hold of it. DEBS, I think it's Delfino Emergency Broadcast Service. How does the graffiti make the shine sprites run in fear? I don't know. <laughs> hey, I think you're in need of a pair of my special sunshades. Oh, well, then again, maybe you're not ready. You need to spend a bit more time here on Isle Delfino. Come on back when you think you're ready for a pair. See ya! I think we need 50 Shine Sprites before we can get the sunglasses. Everyone on this aisle loves to do the box breaker! Just jump up and press the L button above the box! Ka-smash! <laughs> Just one co One coin? That's it? <laughs> well, I'm pleased to see you're safe. I must tell you, we were walking around town earlier and... It seems the area near the Shine Gate is still quite bright. Perhaps you should check it out, Master Mario. Oh, Mario, you're okay after all. I just knew you would be. No, you need more than that. Why is the sky so dark, huh? It's not sun-drenched. This is hardly my idea of a relaxing vacation, Mario. I want to go home right now. <laughs> I've been wrongly imprisoned and you're complaining about the lack of sun? <laughs> Get your priorities straight. Whoa, you just saved me. Thanks, a bundle. Oh. Well, oh well, we tried. <laughs> this is so amazing, isn't it? Where are the TV cameras? Oh wait, is it over already? Did I miss something, huh? This guy is just... This guy's just TikToking the whole experience. <laughs> Dude, shotgun blast is so good. That's true. You can get a good amount of shot sprites before doing that. <laughs> <laughs> oh look, they're just you reusing the same boss over and over again. <laughs> what kind of cut rate production is this? <laughs> there we go. <laughs> I love spraying the NPCs as well. <laughs> Man, this Goger just had a statue collapse. What the heck? Why is evil Mario obsessed with Gogurt? I don't understand. It's Shadow Mario! Peach, how did you not know to ru He was running right at you. Like, that's on you. A kidnapping! Yes, I know. Hey, Toadsworth, what's up? The princess! She's been kidnapped by Master Mario! No, I mean, by someone! Ah! Speedrunner, I am not. Bad. Okay, I'm spraying him. Good lord. There we go. Not fair! Completely unfair! You shouldn't be allowed to use tools like that! And then he just disintegrates. He's heading for the square! Go get him! Oh no, bananas! Hey, bro. Rainbow Gogurt. 
<laughs> he escaped into the graffiti. Try spraying it with water. Here we go. First level. It's Bianco Hills. Road to the big windmill. So the main issue I have with Sunshine is just... I really liked how in Mario 64 it, there was a lot of... Like... There was a lot of ex exploration where you could get basically any star in any order. In this, it's very linear. You have to get star 1, then star 2, then star 3, then star 4. Yeah. I, I, I wish it wasn't linear. It's not as linear as 3D Land or 3D World, which I don't even count as 3D games, but... Here we are, Bianco Hills. I also realize I haven't really used the hover nozzle yet, which is kind of your main method of jumping around. <laughs> okay. So the main reason I wasn't able to get 100% is these the blue coins. The blue coins are hidden all over the place. Here's our first one. I now know that each of the main levels has 30 blue coins in it, so... I actually have a notebook here. Anytime I collect a, a blue coin, I'm going to mark it down in this notebook. Because the game does not keep track of blue coins for you. So there. Bianco Hills. I got my first blue coin. <laughs> I also feel like most of the levels in this game are just kind of tropical or beach themed. Those are so weird, they're like piranha balls. Yikes. Man, everybody's freaking out right now. <laughs> Whee! Okay, well, those guys just keep making more and more goop. Oh no! It's another one of these uh, Gogurt piranhas. I'm going to get blue coins as I see them and mark them down. But I'm not necessarily going to go out of my way to collect them on the missions. <laughs> what is Gogurt? Uh, <laughs> it's pre-packaged yogurt that you can, like, take the top off and just kind of drink it as you go. It's probably only in America, and it's disgusting. Shine! Let us save.